All right, people. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Brian, aka the Spiritual Warrior, ladies and gentlemen. Now, on this day's video, today's video, we are going to talk about disconnecting people, which means distance yourself from these type of people. Because these type of people will bring bad energy, bad vibes that it is. So many for everybody to stay tuned at the end of this very video. Share this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And do not forget to turn your notifications on so every time I upload a video, y'all will be the first one to get notified. But with that being said, folks, let's get started. It's time to distance yourself from these type of people. They do not want to see you happy, ladies and gentlemen. The moment you start seeing jealousy, envious, or any type of behavior, no matter who it's from or where it's coming from, it is time to distance yourself from these people. Because if you don't, you're going to be in a heat world of trouble. Not only that, you're going to be feeling bad. Because when you hang around these type of people, they're going to snatch away your energy. These people are so snatchers. They will snatch it away. They will snatch your happiness away. I am telling you. You got to be very beware of these type of people. They do not want to see you happy. They don't want to see you, excuse me, make it to the next level. That's why I'm telling you, no matter who these people is, you must distance yourself immediately. Cut these people off immediately. Listen to what I'm saying now. It's time for you to start cutting a lot of people off, ladies and gentlemen. Not to sound selfish, not to sound rude or anything like that, but if they don't want to see you happy, if they send in jealousy towards your way, my advice to you is get away from them. Cut them off right now before it's too late. Because the moment you still got these people into your life and you still got them hanging around with you, let me tell you something. They can poke holes in your ship. They're going to try to sabotage you, slander you, trying to stop your blessings. They're going to try to do everything all because you are happy, all because you're doing well for yourself. And a lot of people don't like when you're doing well for yourself. It triggers them. It triggers the nervous side of these people. But you walk around here acting like everybody is your friend. You walk around here with everybody thinking they're happy for you. News flash and breaking news. Everybody ain't your friend and everybody ain't going to be happy for you. This is why I am letting you know right now. If you got these type of people into your life. I mean, excuse me, in your life. That's hating on you for no apparent reason. You need to distance yourself away from them. Love them from a distance, but at the same time. Know who you are facing. And what I mean by that is. These people, they're going to show you your true colors. And when you see people's true colors, don't try to repaint it. Don't try to overlook it. You saw what you saw. God showed you that for a reason. Don't be like, oh, it was just an accident. Oh, he was just playing. Oh, she was just playing. They was not playing. They was very serious. This is why I'm telling you right now. Get away from them before they try to mess up your life. Because these people, they will try to mess up your life, ladies and gentlemen. If you let them. But do not, do not let these people ruin your life. I don't care who they are. Do not let them ruin your life. Because they will try it. But no weapon formed against you, once again, shall not prosper. I got to remind y'all that. Because I don't care how big they is or how big the giant or the devil think he is. Nobody, and I mean nobody, cannot stop your blessings. Get away from toxic people. Get away from people that like to start drama. Get away from people that just like to run their mouth constantly. Get away from, get away from them. 
before you find yourself in some serious BS. You're going to wish like hell you should have had listened. When your gut tuition tell you something about somebody, you listen. Don't wait till it's too late. If your gut tuition tell you something ain't right about something or about this person, you get away from them. ASA freaking P. When your gut tuition is telling you something, that means that's God's talking to you right there and right now. Because God, he really sends some warning shines towards you. Whether you like it or not, he is going to warn you about these people. He don't care who they are or who they label themselves as. If they bad for you, if they toxic, if they spreading drama, if they don't want to see you happy, they, <laughs> they give you these ugly, mean look faces towards you. You need to get away from them. Because I'm telling you right now, people, <laughs> people will try so hard. I mean, so hard to try to hide their jealousy towards you. But they know deep down inside, they cannot hide it. These people are very, very jealous of you. And sooner or later, it ain't going to no longer be hidden. They're going to end up exposing themselves. So, I'm telling you right now, don't be surprised when somebody lash out at you, start cussing you out for no apparent reason. They ain't nothing but the devil inside of these people, folks. Get away from them. Get away from them. Get the hell away from them. You can do this thing all by yourself. Solo. You don't need them to support you. You have strangers coming up to you, supporting you. They don't even know you. So these people that send you all these bad energy, bad attentions towards you, cut them off. Cut them off right now. Before it gets too late. And before you find yourself in some serious, serious heat. Because once you get yourself in some serious stuff, trust me, you're going to be praying and talking to God like I should have listened. That's just fine. If your good tuition is telling you Get out of that place or get away from that person. It's time to go. You about to move. When God says move, you about to move right now. Don't never disobey what the Most High is trying to tell you. Because he will send singles and messages towards your way that you need to move or get away from a certain type of person or certain type of people. It don't take much for me. For my gut to start talking and I will and I will remove myself or get away from people. That is toxic and drama. But that's what you got to do as well, ladies and gentlemen. Remove yourself from any toxicity or people that fill with drama or filled with hatred or just plain out evil. Get away from these people. Get away, get away, get away. Because you don't want to get caught up in that BS. You don't want to get up, tangled up in that little spider way up. And now you trapping nowhere to go. But y'all know what I'm trying to say. You don't want to get up caught in nobody's BS. Do this thing by yourself. Don't tell nobody what you are doing. Don't tell nobody a single soul, ladies and gentlemen. Do it alone. Do not tell nobody your business. Don't tell nobody a doggone thing. Do this thing all by yourself. <clears throat> Excuse me. Do this thing alone, folks. You don't need none of that support. The last time I checked, the most high, he will get you there. But you got to get up and do the work yourself. You think you need these people to support you? No, you do not. You do not need them. None whatsoever. But let me tell you something. They need you. And they need you for a reason. Because you make them happy. You bring the joy into their life. But at the same time, these people is very jealous of you. They envious of you. 
They hate you, but love you at the same time. You don't want them. You don't want them type of people around you. You don't need them type of people around you. You need true friends. You need friends in your circle, not friend enemies or people that depend. To, uh, excuse me, that pretend to like you. You don't need that type of energy in your life. This is why I'm telling you. Excuse me. Distant yourself from a lot of these people. Distant yourself before it is too late. Run away, crawl, walk, or run if you need to. Excuse me. Because when the when God said get away from this person, get away from her, get away from him, get away from this group of people, we need to get away from them. Because some ain't right. And you know what some don't feel right. And you can just feel it. You're like, mm, some don't feel right. And when some don't feel right, you better listen. If some don't feel right about a certain type of place, you better get out of there. If some don't feel right, if some don't feel right about this person, you better move and get the hell away from them before it's too late. Don't wait at the last minute and be like, oh God, I wish I should have had listened to you. And no, 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 no. We we do not want to be doing that. Do it right now and do it before it's too freaking late. Because I know a lot of people like to stay in these toxic environments. And they know they had seen it coming. And that they got themselves in some serious mess. Don't let that be you. Listen to your gut tuition. If your body is, if your body is alerting you about somebody or something, you listen. And mark my words. When you do listen, you could be thanking God that you're not in some serious mess or some drama or got caught up in some mess. That's the only thing you need to be careful for. Be careful who you hang around. Be careful who you call your friend. And be careful who you bring around your loved ones. Family. Be careful who you bring around. Because there's a lot of jealousy can be here inside of a lot of people. But lots of it too. This is why I want you right now. Before you get close to somebody. Check that background history. See if that meant to have us in check, folks. But if you see one red flag in somebody, distance yourself. Cut them off. There's a whole lot of people out there in the world. You will soon meet the right person or have the right friend in your circle. Have it be that's one or two, who cares? Just be careful who you surrounding yourself by. And you around a bunch of fake phony snakes? Cut them off right now and immediately before you end up getting bit. But ladies and gentlemen, that was my warning for you. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And I will catch you on the next one. Adios.